Hi, it's John. This is the second video in the series I'm doing about the melodic minor modes and how we can use our pentatonic style box shapes to get the sounds of all the other modes. So, in the first video, we had a look at the melodic minor scale itself, or the jazz melodic minor, and then the second mode, the D Dorian flat 2. So, we were adapting the D Dorian flat 2 in five pentatonic based scale shapes to get all of the other modes. So, where I'm going to take off is just a brief recap of those scales. I'm going to show you how those sound. If you don't know what happened in the first video, please go and find it. It's on this playlist and you can have a look at it. So, this is D Dorian flat 2 being applied over a C minor major 7 chord sequence. So, this is going to give us the first mode, which is C jazz melodic minor. minus seven chord groove so this is the second mode of a melodic minor scale based in C so this is going to be our D Dorian flat 2 so all I need to do is play those five scale systems over the D minus seven chord in their positions and then I get the D Dorian flat 2 Time round, we're looking at the third mode, which has to be played over the third chord. So the third chord in C melodic minor is E flat augmented. And the scale sound you're going to get by playing our D Dorian flat 2 over this chord is E flat Lydian augmented. It's a really cool sound. And what I'm going to do is just play the scale systems that we've been doing from video one and show you how it sounds over this. Over this chord, we want to be playing our D Dorian flat 2 scale. And what that does is gives you the sound of E flat Lydian augmented. Lydian augmented doesn't have to be hard to play over. It's a really simple concept if we're using these five patterns from video one. The next video, we're going to be looking at Lydian dominant, which is the fourth mode, and it can be played over seven chords. So it's really common. Seven chords happen in loads of tunes, so come and watch the video.